What's going on guys welcome into my channel ripex with a brand new season and with brand new video update to guys boosting your fps in fortnite chapter 3 so guys in this video i'm going to show you a brand new method to boosting your fps as you also see in the starting of my video guys how much performance increase you will get after watching my this video so guys let's start this video so guys first of all you need to download this fortnite chapter 3 fps boost pack on your pc link of this pack into the descriptions of my video so guys simply open the link from descriptions and that will take you here onto my website go for the search icon and search here chapter 3 fps boost so guys once you search chapter 3 fps boost pack onto this website so guys you will go to this pack onto this website click here on this image scroll down go for this download button and download this pack on their pc once you click so guys click on the subscribe on the youtube button and guys make sure to subscribe to my channel and turn on the bell notifications therefore you never miss out any next video update from my this channel so guys once you subscribe and turn on the bell notifications so this link will be automatically guys unlock on your pc after subscribing my channel then click on this unlock link button and that will take you onto this google drive click on this download button and download this pack on your pc i have already guys download this pack so simply guys open the file drag this folder and drop it here on your desktop now open this folder here's guys a bunch of files for boosting or optimizing your pc for the new chapter 3 of the fortnite so open this first folder and here is the some registry optimizations file for the gaming for your all the expect of your pc for your cpu gpu memory ram network everything so guys let's go and install this registry files so guys simply double click here and click yes click yes again click ok and do the same for all these registry files on your pc So guys here once you install all of the registry files on your pc now go back into the previous folder and next here is the program folder where we have these three program on this boost pack which is for your ram optimizations for the cpu optimization and for the gpu optimizations so guys let's go and use the software so first of all double click here and install the software on your pc click ok click next and simply install this software on your pc i have already installed this software on my pc you can check it out here and this is still running in my background whenever i turn on my pc so guys let's go into software and i just show you the best settings for the software which i recommend you to guys do on your pc for boosting your fps so guys here is the interface of the mz ram booster software so what you need to do first of all guys here you will find out this option which is the system information here is my all the guys ram information which i have the 60 gb of the ram go for the second tab which is the system speed up so guys follow all of my the settings click on the disable and the fs last access update and check mark onto the cpu priority tweaks which is the boost foreground application which is running in the front of your screen like your game or any kind of software which you are running so simply check mark on this option then check mark onto the automatic and running task and follow all of my settings then click on this apply value and apply the settings on your pc then go for the next option which is the options tab now here guys you need to follow all of the settings carefully for optimizing your ram so here you will find out the automatic optimize if ram free is below mb so you need to type here 2500 and follow all of this my value into the same guys location on also on your pc in the software so guys once you do it now check mark here onto this option which is the load on windows startup and guys leave these options then hit on the apply button and apply all the settings on your pc so guys once you do it now simply close out the software this will keep running in your background but guys make sure to run this software as the administrator when you turn on otherwise this will not apply the settings next software is for the cpu optimizations and this is the park controller one of the best software for it so simply guys double click here and also install this software on your pc i have already guys installed this software on my pc i just show you real quick it is also running in my background whenever i boot up my pc so here is the interface so what settings you need to do that is guys cpu settings for the power profile guys you need to select the bit some high performance for this power plant for the software click on the may activate set all these options or to disable select all this slider onto the 100 percent hit apply check mark onto the bitsum dynamic boost enable you will get this option select out the bitsum high performance again from this list click ok 
click ok again and guys here we are done with our park controller and this will keep running in your background whenever guys you turn on your pc now open the boost pack next here is software which is the throttle stop and this is guys the best software for gpu optimization if you have the amd or the intel gpu guys it doesn't matter guys simply open the zip file drag all of these files on your desktop and this is the guys main exe file simply guys drag it here on your desktop double click here on this exe file click yes click ok and guys here is the interface of this software so guys what settings you need to do here guys first of all you will find out here this option which is the performance so you need to select this option onto the gaming then check mark onto the high performance and also follow all of the settings on your pc then click on this turn on options and now simply guys minimize the software and this will also keep running here in your background whenever guys you turn on your pc if it is not so guys make sure to run this software on your background before playing the fortnite or launching your fortnite once guys you do install all of these programs on your pc and do all of the settings now here is our chapter 3 best configuration settings which you can use on your low end pc or very low end pc so guys you can use it according to your pc build so guys i will not guys suggest you to use it so guys if you have a very low end pc and if you use this folder on your pc so you will get some extra fps so guys open this folder simply right click here click copy then guys press windows r together from your keyboard type your app data click ok go for this local folder press f from your keyboard go for the fortnite game folder save config windows client and simply replace this file click on the space button click on replace the file destinations and guys here we are done with over this installation of this file so once you do it now guys go back into the main directory and here is our last folder which is the timer resolution and this is actually for reducing delay of our mouse and the keyboard so open this folder simply drag it here on your desktop i already have one here on my pc double click here click on this maximum button and minimize the software before launching the fortnite so guys once you use this boost pack on your pc now i'm going to show you some best settings for your windows for optimizing your fortnite or for getting the better performance from your windows 10 or 11 while you are gaming so guys first of all press windows r together from your keyboard type here temp and press enter press ctrl a from your keyboard and guys delete all of these files click continue click do this for all file click continue and guys here we are done now close out this folder now press windows r together from your keyboard but guys now this time simply put the percentage sign before and after this and press enter this will take you here simply again press ctrl a from your keyboard and delete these files again from your pc click continue and guys here we are done now click cancel click yes click continue again and click close so guys once you do this setting now here is the last step of this video which is guys actually optimize your fortnite in-game settings so guys you need to open this pc go for the drive where you have installed your fortnite so i have installed here into my this program file on my c drive go for the epic game fortnite fortnite games binary win64 and this is the drive where we have guys installed over fortnite and this is the all the exit file or the launcher file of the fortnite go for the properties of your these files one by one go for the compatibility option check mark onto the disable full screen optimizations then go for the change high dpi and also check mark onto this option click ok hit apply click ok and do the same settings for your all these files i have already guys done these settings on my pc once you do guys simply close out it now just simply one time restart your pc because the settings which we have done on our pc that will be take effect after restarting your pc so guys let's restart our pc and jump into the fortnite and test out the fps in battle royale
Thank <laughs> you.